What's up everybody? It's Dark Alliance Toys. Welcome back to another video. Today we're going to be taking a look at the Joy Toy Warhammer 40,000 Umbrella tool bag. He is part of the Salamanders of the Space Marine team. And now, like I said before, when I reviewed the Ultramarine, I don't know a lot about Warhammer. And I probably should do a little more research, but these dudes... I, I think Salamanders are my favorite. I just love the green. It's just a great color. Uh, we'll quickly go through, through the articulation here. I think it's all pretty much standard on all Joy Toy figures. There is... Where did that fall, by the way? I don't know where that popped out of. Interesting. Alright. So, articulation here, there is a ball at the top of the head, so you get all kinds of nice movement. Not looking down a whole lot, but nice swivel. And then, you can swivel, I think you can swivel the arm while I don't want to damage anything there. There's double elbow, and then the, all the hands are on a ball. There's... Oops, probably you can tell if you can see him. Crazy art back. Really nice crunch forward for a guy in a giant suit. And then kicks out. There is a double knee. And then there is a little pooch. A lot of flight up and down. There is a toe joint. And then some nice swivel. Maybe don't pop out the uh, arm here. And then quick look at all the all the detail in here. The crest right here, or the insignia on the front looks really good. This is applied very very nicely. And then this like dragon insignia is raised. It's not painted on it. I separately I think separately applied. It looks really good though. Skip can't figure out where this piece fell off. I will worry about that later. Are we gonna count it as an accessory? Yeah, I think so. So there's this piece. It goes somewhere. It almost looks like I broke it off though, which it's kinda of, kinda of suck if I did that. And I would not mean to. Alright. So for accessories here comes with this I, I actually don't know this is it's like some kind of backpack and that will just go right there it's amazing like how that's chunky but this thing can still just stay there nice and flat there is an alternate head sculpt as well this looks really good I don't know if you can see that, but his eyes are like this deep red. And then he has this nice scar in here. And all you do is just pop the head off of here. But I like these guys with their helmets on. It just looks cool. But since this is a named character, I might, I might switch that out. There is a holster, <coughs> holster uh, pistol here with some writing and stuff on it. And that will that can plug in. You can take off these like pouches and all this stuff and on there. Next up we got the chainsaw sword. This looks really really good. It looks almost the same as the one on the on the ultramarine which I have next to me. Yeah, they look. Pretty much identical. There might be some slight paint differences, but that's about it. And then we got this here. Is this the bolter rifle? Bolt rifle. Although on the ultramarines, his uh, cord here does not have that extra those extra bolts on. So this might be something different. 
And then there's the bolter. I think this is called the bolter tool sorry. Oh, and the magazine removes it. See, I never knew that. I was just prying on it. That's really cool. And you can see there were bolts in there too. I sculpted. They didn't even have to sculpt that in there, but they did. And then there's some alternate hands. Trigger finger hand for the side. Sword wielding hand for that side. And he does have a pair of fists for both hands. If you want to go get fisticuffs with him. And then on this hand, he has like a splayed out hand or get ready to see here. Joints just a ball on these are just stupid. Seems like the hand's too small to Okay, I think I got it. Whoops. It seemed like the both of the hand was too small. I think it is. That's interesting. I haven't really messed with this figure since I got him. So I have to put nice tags on this. There we go. That one went on nice and easy. But yeah, I've been, I have absolutely been loving collecting the uh the joy toy warhammer stuff this is the only i only have two figures from this lion but i have absolutely been having a ball playing with them and i do want to get do want to get more because these are some of the most fun action figures I've ever I have ever played with. They just post so fluent. Like these are the easiest figures I've ever had a, like a joy to pose with. Like yeah, that's a mid pose, but like either way, it's a really really great looking figure. And then let me get him in a neutral stance really quick before I end this video. Here is the ultramarine. I think they're pretty much the same size, but they look really good next to each other. Really, really good. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out.